2-0. 4-1 victory today in the FA Trophy. Overall, looking at your team's performance, how happy are you? Uh, I was happy with the second half performance, but the first half was unacceptable. And the first 20 minutes, I thought, was really, really poor. So we started very badly, but uh, I'm pleased to say that we improved in the second half. And the players, I felt, had a point to prove, and I wanted them to prove a point. And certainly in the second half, they were a lot better. So um, you're always pleased when they respond to what you say, but uh, there shouldn't have been any reason that they needed to, to uh, get a kick up the, the backside because they should have started the game, the game well. They knew what to expect and um, they didn't carry out those instructions early on. And overall, looking at the FA Trophy as a competition, so where, where is that in the priority list for your team on a whole? It's very important. You're only in two FA competitions and you're not going to win the FA Cup, so the trophy is very important. Um, we've drawn a really difficult tie in, uh, in the next round, but, but that, that's, what the, that's what the cup can throw. You've got to take what you get, and it's a difficult to uh, you know, draw, but we wanted, we wanted to be in the hat, and um, we wanted to get through this game tonight. Young Adam Wrightson today looked brilliant, and it's clear that the fans have also taken to him. How much potential does he have, and what are the sort of challenges of managing a talent that young? Uh, well, I've had talented players before, and uh, I think you're, you're trying to look after them as well as as well as try and help their career. Um, but he's a, a young lad with a great attitude. Uh, I think he is exciting to watch. I think the supporters need to have somebody who they can identify with, and he's a local lad, and he's he's got bags of um, energy and pace, and he's direct. And uh, I'm really, really pleased with him. He's uh, a, a lad who. As I say, um, he's one. He's, he's well. I was going to say he's one for the future, but he's, he's in the team now on merit. And um, as I say, he's got a, a good future ahead of him. We just have to, you know, not expect, you know, things too quickly. He's still learning, but um, he certainly, he certainly made a good start to his career. And just last then, turn attention to the league. Um, next Saturday, got booking. It's the sort of idea for yourself to maybe try and get the second half performance and have that the whole way through next week. I, I, I think we need to we need to get the tempo like we did in the second half. When we obviously need to to make chances and get balls in the box like we did in that second half, and we obviously need to do that for longer periods. But um, we have need to be tight at, at the back than we were in the first half because we we gifted a goal. And then we were sloppy, which led to well, keep having to tip one on the bar. And we can't afford that against Woking, because if we do, as we've seen against uh, Southport, that first game is very important. First goal, sorry, it's very important. And we need to, we need to get that on Saturday. Excellent. Well, thank you for your time, Neil. No problem. Thank you.